Hey subscribers, so just a small rage video. I collected stock this morning and saw these 15 PS5s piled up in the supplier's office. Believe it or not, these 15 PlayStation 5s is for one customer, a console scalper who will probably be selling them off at over 20,000 Rand each. These PS5s are bundled with three games and an extra DualSense controller for 16,000 Rand. For my viewers in the US, that's a whopping 1,000 one hundred and twenty dollars at the current exchange rate. As a noob tuber who would love to get one of these bad boys for an unboxing and review video there is just no way that I could afford one at such a ridiculous price. Put it this way there aren't that many South Africans that could afford sixteen thousand rand plus for a gaming console. Gone are the days where a video game console for example the Sega Mega Drive or Sega Genesis for the American viewers was 500 Rand. I'm going back to 1991. South Africa being a third world country due to its economic status is heading down Poo Creek fast with no paddle in sight. The sad reality is that the South African Rand has drastically depreciated so inflation has drastically increased. Adding to the mix are the in-between agencies and entities wanting their fat slice of the pie and don't give a fig about us gaming consumers. The same goes for IT related items such as graphics cards, CPUs, SSDs, monitors, so on and so on. In fact, all electronics and tech peripherals suffer thanks to our weak currency and greedy agencies and entities. This has led to major software piracy and an influx of cheap, non quality controlled Chinese goods and products. I can rant and rave hours upon hours, but I think I've said enough. To all you console scalpers out there, enjoy it while it lasts. All good things come to an end. I'd love to hear your thoughts. Tell me which country you're from and if you have the same issue as we are having here in South Africa. Leave your comments below. Thanks for listening. Till next time.